Are we though? What? Are we? I think we're going to attempt to pull it in, aren't we? We'll get it in. I don't know if it'll work. Before we do it, yeah. and the camera's out, we've got a, we got a tradition. When you go on holiday. Tradition? Tr prediction. Yeah. A tradition. Oh. When we go on holiday, unless you're Jack, you buy something <laughs> when you're there and bring it back for the lads, don't you? <laughs> <I'm awesome. laughs> so I've got you both a present. What? No, you can't put that on. Is it pulling? What? That looks not powerful now, is it? That's for you. Oh, and this is for you. Hey, it's, it's the world's smallest violin. No. Oh. Crack toys. <laughs> <laughs> is it? Oh yeah. It's a frog beer ball. <laughs> I'm off the beer at the minute. I'm going to have to wait. And you can keep up with us now with the points. <laughs> <laughs> After your third one, you can stay out with us and get it filled up. <laughs> Stoke, need your help. Is that the uh, first time you felt big next to a, go, uh, a beer jug? <laughs> yeah. How many points are you going to have, mate? What's it saying? Prague. That's about that wrong. Oh, I have that. It's in Prague, it's, it's, it's in two. Oh, yeah. got two things on it. But yeah, anyway. Cheers, mate. You can throw them. Is that big bet? <laughs> I got. No, so that there, right, yeah, is the very famous clock that's in Prague uh, Square. Basically Big Ben. No, no, and that clock is the only one of that clock in the world, and it tells the time in four different ways. Nah, I've so got one in my back garden, or you, you got one. <laughs> you can't tell the time. you got a sundial. Yeah. Uh, you got five days. And Thank you, easy. Dave. Yeah, no problem, lads. Is it still the same price? What do you mean? If I fill this up at the pub, if I say, can I bring me out? Yeah! You can have your own, remember, you, my granddad used to have it, oh, his I, own glass I, behind the bar. Do you know when you go to the pub and you say, can I just try a bit of that? Yeah. You get oh, a point, a point. Point. He'll be able to keep up with us now, so you know that third one? He'll be able to fill that up and keep what going. Do do? What? Like, Jack does loads more than mine. It's a fidget Spin. spinner. It rings. It gets Katie's attention. Like there you go, look! I need my beer opening. There you go. Can. Just ring your bell. I don't like him, so I have to really try with him and make it look like I do with you. I can just get you anything you're happy. <laughs> Back to the engine. You go with the oh. so I think what we, the plan is, get it underneath the car, let, get the car down, and then get the crane and lift it up yeah. into the, onto the mount. Sounds like a good plan to me. Good to me. Sounds good. Right. right, let's get this in. I ain't even gonna lie. I... Oh, Jesus Christ! Man. This is why we call you every Andy Jack. <laughs> Let it go down a bit more, Jack. Come. Oh. He's all there with him, is it? That's a tight old beast, ain't she? I think we need to come down to like level it all up. Sleeker engine's easy, yeah? Mate, hey, it's pretty easy. It, it wasn't bad, it was it? It would be easy if we didn't have a pallet and a pallet truck in yeah, the way. that's true. If we'd have just positioned the engine. It's a tight fit. If we'd, I reckon if we, the problem is, if we need, somebody needs to come up with an invention that the engine goes on and yeah, can move, the, shift to the left, Go no, to the back no, and get, pivot. You can get a crane what mounts the top turrets like that each side, and then you drop it in. And you can adjust it. Yeah, like no, that. but to start with, because you don't want it on yeah, the deck. But we was a bit. Confused. You know, like a swizzle chair. If we had an engine swizzle, swizzle crane. chair, swizzle crane, and uh, no, just as a stand, and it could do that, and then go back and forward. Don't get painting in it, because Dave be round your house. If somebody comes up with that now, mate, I will come round. He'll be asking, he'll be having his hand out, so can I have 50 You can't paint in it now, you've said it on camera. You're going to have to block that out, because I'm painting in that. It probably exists, a swizzle crane. I'm going to have a look. Don't! Swizzle engine crane. Listen. Dave swizzle engine crane. No. The swizzle engine. No, it's not a swizzle engine crane. It's a swizzle <laughs> engine stand swizzle. because. Yeah, but that's an engine stand there. No, 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 no. Because an engine stand, it stands there. But a swizzle, you pull it on, you lower it down onto it, and it's got eight legs, eight feet, and it goes left, right, no. forward, and it spins like that. 
Trust me, don't block all this out. <laughs> Spider swizzle. Don't block all this out, right? Yeah. Just put like. Din, 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 din. Like, just put, you know, like. Malibu. Wait. You Malibu. know, like Malibu. waiting room music. Yeah, yeah. And just put Dave's idea. Din, 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 din. <laughs> it's just Cog's turn. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah. enough of that. What was kind of. When it sat on the pallet as well, the engine was kind of. Tilted. Well, it was upright, weren't it? We just presume that's how the engine sits, but it don't. It actually, like Jack says, it tilt. It sits on a tilt backwards. So I think it made it a bit bigger how we had it. Yeah. You're on a tilt, aren't you? Getting angry at me, Dave. Is it because you're hungry? Did you get angry? Yeah. Don't, don't do that. You've, you've caught this. Anyway, we've got pipes and hoses and we've cables and everything connect. connected. We've got to get that. Cabling down, back down TCU. It ain't just, let's turn the key, is it? Oh. It's still a lot to do. Because you're getting ready for holiday, aren't you? Yeah, getting ready. You're going to get I've ready got, for holiday. Well, it's got one got, pair of Reeboks, one pair no, I've of... I've got four windows, a back door, yeah. and a set of stairs, and then I can go on all And then connect this engine up, and then I yeah. can go back on all this. And then yeah. the bottom subframe and that can go on. Yes. Prop shaft needs cleaning and painting. I need to figure the fuel lines out. I know, yeah, I do feel like I could do this tonight. Well, look, I could put that on there. And that no, no, but with that, is that going to be in the way of anything? No, no, no look at that. Go on, look at it. Oh, I'm not going to connect it, because unless we tighten it. You got, what have you put on? Tighten it. Tighten it, yeah, yeah, yeah. because you'll just think it's done. Right, let's get cracking. <laughs> Stokes gone away. Stokes has gone away and he's left yeah. us too. And to finish rebuild, put and send you back together. Well, by the time he comes back, we'll probably have to take it all apart again because we've done everything wrong. Um, I'm sure we can figure it out, can't we? Yeah. Come on, well, we're getting some new stuff in, you know. Bolt on bolt off gear. <laughs> 2023. <laughs> With a slight wing damage. <laughs> Playing the problem, Dave. So, You're doing so well. Come over here. We've got all quick, quick recap. So we've got the subframes on. We've even worked out that this, I don't even know, you've got a bottom subframe, then a split subframe, and then it goes up to the engine mounts to the back and front. We've got the, the exhaust in, we've got this drive shaft in, mint. And now we're having problems. So we tried to put it in this side. And what we did was we fed the hub in, for the hub part in first, then tried to put the gearbox end in, and I don't know what we did, but we pushed it down, didn't we? We pushed the and then we, out the end. We sucked it back up and it just all dropped into the <laughs> boot. So we're having a nightmare at the moment. I we, know what you're going to say, we should have put that end in first, taken yes, off the truck rod end. But the... Stoke, for some <laughs> unknown reason, has built everything up to take everything apart to put the drive shaft in. And he told me the other day, when we was doing a, a pipe at the back, one of the fuel pipes, he went, why don't you just undo this pipe and this bolt? He went, I don't, I don't like undoing stuff. I feel like I'm going back on myself. And look what we're having to do. Now he's broke the drive shaft. <laughs> We've used four gallon of um, grease. grease to get it all back up. Poor Cozzy Dave, yeah, right, he's, he's slaving away, slaving away. <laughs> and we're just having a nightmare, so we might fix it and we might not. So <laughs> if we fix it, Stokes will never know and we won't tell him. <laughs> but if we don't fix it, it means a trip to our mates in Birmingham who Cozzy, da Cozzy Dave determined. Re rebuild drive shafts. You won't show his face. We're having a go. <laughs> Why is he not allowed to? You want to be honest? He's not on the sex offender list that he's not allowed <laughs> to be shown. 
Because he, uh, you know, his face has been on the channel before. He's not now like on any like YouTube sex offender list. Star City. Jesus, Jesus Christ, Jack. What are you doing to the poor kid? People are thinking, why can't we see Cosy Dave? No, why has he changed his appearance? Well, we have these little setbacks every now and again, don't we? It's all your huffing and puffing you doing that. Uh... Only huffed this morning. <laughs> you did have a huff this morning. <laughs> Oh, it's hard, lovely. Penny, freeloader. <laughs> it's a good thing for Dave, isn't it, Dave? Oh, yeah. You good. fucking caught your glove there, ain't you, mate? Look at that. Yeah. It's... Yo, oh, Stokey, you ain't got to panic, man. <laughs> we got this! Cosy Dave left before we broke it again, but... Yeah, um, Cosy Dave left. He did play a big part in it. But I've managed to reuse this, um, the clip. Um, we've tidied it up. I've got to get it back and now, before we And now, <laughs> what I'm going to do is, though, take it back up. Undo the track rod end. And then whip it on. <laughs> Done. We're off. We're off. We're off. Jack's got to edit for five hours. It takes him two. Course he's averted. Uh, last one in. Little arms are in now after all these. We need Stoke. Taking applications. Mate, we do a better job than him. He bodges stuff. But he ain't bodging nothing on this car. <laughs> so after some scratching our heads, huffing and puffing, bit of stress. We're almost completing the engine bay. We've literally got to get a, an, a battery, that, the proper battery that's going to fit it, because the battery that we've got is too tall. Then we'll be able to just fit, finish that little bit there. We have no idea what this plug does, so if anybody knows, comment. We've got to do fuel lines, we've got to put fluids in, so oils, coolant, you name it. Yeah, the fluid brakes. Yeah, yeah all everything. that sort of stuff. We're getting some tyres next week for the wheels so then they can go on. So then literally, hard, literally, the next episode on this, fingers crossed, she should be running and driving. Yep. Then we're gonna have to give the interior a real good blast over, and then we're gonna turn our attention to the bodywork and get that sorted. Yep. Hopefully that don't take a year. No. But we won't be doing a lot of that. No, we? no, we we'll ain't gonna. We, to we ain't gonna do the bodywork. So yeah, then, as always, hope you hope you enjoyed yourself. Leave comments, whatever you want to do. Slag us off, <laughs> moan at us, ask where the cosy is. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, like, follow, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell icon for up and coming videos and we'll see you on the next episode. See you later.